What's up, y'all? This is really all back with another video. Y'all, son, today we got to talk about the Dallas Mavericks because I believe y'all should pursue Bradley Bill. But before we get into that, I need you to smash that subscribe button. And if you already subscribed to my channel, share it to somebody who ain't subscribed because with y'all, I know I can get there. And when y'all are done with that, I need you to hover over to that like button and smash that too so we can tell the YouTube algorithm to share this video with the world. But with all that being said, we got to jump straight into this topic because I truly feel like y'all need to get Bradley Bill. And I'm going to list some of the reasons why I think bradley bill would help your team immediately now a lot of people know bradley bill is a dog you get what i'm saying like bradley bill is a dog that gets underrated because his team is so terrible right and the washington wizards is a bunch of clucks right now like as we seem via the off season bradley bill just needed some help and what did they do with the player that was giving them some help in russell westbrook they traded him for some people that may be top 50 in the league, you know what I'm saying? Like, they got him Kuzma, they got um, Spencer Dinwiddie, who was a good player, don't get me wrong, but they got him Kuzma, they got him Montrez Harrell, KCP, you know what I'm saying? Like, is that truly better than what y'all already had? Absolutely not. And I just feel like Bradley Bill sh should have or should be tired of having clucks, you get what I'm saying? And I think the Dallas Mavericks gotta save them, right? Like, don't get me wrong, there's a lot of teams in the NBA that could utilize a Bradley Bill, you get what I'm saying? Because Bradley Bill is just that, just that special, and he can just compliment any team, but I really think he would compliment the Dallas Mavericks because of the star y'all already have in Luka Doncic, while also eliminating pressure from Kristoff Porzingis, which I think a lot of people realize must happen immediately. Now, the first reason why Bradley Bill will immediately be impactful on the Dallas Mavericks is because he brings star power, right? People in the league respects his offensive abilities, right? And as we've seen in the playoff, Luka Doncic gets double team a lot, right? But when you add a player like Bradley Bill, who is respected offensively like he is, who is going to give you 20 plus every single night consistently, right? That is... That does, that's going to lower the amount of double teams Luka Doncic is going to face in the playoff when it matters, right? And by result of that, now that gives other players more ability to score, right? Because all the pressure is going to be on Luka, Bradley Bill, who is able to handle it. And now Luka Doncic can do what he does best and score and facilitate the ball and get people the best shot possible. The second reason why I know Bradley Bill will immediately work, and it kind of plays off my first reason... Bradley Bill is going to be a consistent bucket, right? He's going to be consistent. Like, Bradley Bill is a bucket. Like, everybody knows what he does. You get what I'm saying? Everybody knows what he does. It's just a matter of giving Bradley Bill the stage to really show the world what he can do, right? And when you pair him up with Luka Doncic, you get what I'm saying? And KP, that team is crazy. You get what I'm saying? Because a lot of people was questioning Dallas. If they did enough in the offseason, I feel like they could have did more. I understand the the premise behind getting a couple of shooters to fill up with Luka Doncic. So in, in that, that case where he does get double, he can kick it out and, you know, he got some efficient shooters. But it's still going to be a time since he is the primary scorer and a lot of times he is the only scorer. A lot of teams is going to is gonna bank on that. You know what I'm saying? They're going to be willing to die on all the shooters beating them you get what i'm saying like a lot of teams is not gonna want to get beat by luka Doncic because if luka Doncic beat you his momentum his attitude changes and i can really change the trajectory of a series third reason why bradley bill would instantly instantly work on the dallas mavericks is because he lowers the amount of pressure Kristoff Przingis has you get what i'm saying because now when Kristoff Przingis presumably gets hurt or if he's not on that night, Bradley Bill is going to be on. You get what I'm saying? And now KP doesn't have to live with the pressure that he didn't do this. He didn't average 20 and 10. He didn't average 30. And you get what I'm saying? He's going to be able to play what play his role. You get what I'm saying? Now, I know Christoph Przingis is saying he wants to be a little bit more engaged in the offense. But with, with the new addition of Jason Kidd as coach, I'm pretty sure he's going to have more schemes that's going to get KP more involved with Luka Doncic and if you get Bradley Bill that offense is going to be crazy and I think this would allow KP to be a lot more efficient defensively where the Dallas Mavericks need him to be they need him to be a present uh, defensively and I think Bradley Bill gives him the opportunity to be that when he is a offensive scorer I'm telling y'all the Dallas Mavericks is going to be the favorite to acquire 
Bradley Bill. I think y'all gonna be a favorite to acquire a couple of stars once it becomes a little bit more noisy. Like, because even with Damian Lillard, I think y'all could be a front runner for him now. I know a lot of people are saying, you know, uh, Portland might trade him to the Sixers. That would make sense. But I think the Dallas Mavericks is gonna be aggressive. I think low key, the reason why they wasn't as aggressive in the offseason is because they, they kind of know some stuff is gonna happen. You get what I'm saying? Like I'm like I'm not gonna sit here and say the Dallas Mavericks is is tampering, which they could be, but I do believe the Dallas Mavericks have a long term goal here. They have to because Luka Doncic wants to win. You get what I'm saying? You can see it in his face. You can see it in how he plays the game of basketball that the Dallas Mavericks and Luka Doncic wants to win, and the Dallas Mavericks is going to try to upgrade their roster every every moment they get in order to keep Luka Doncic happy, especially now that they paid him. And they have to show Luka Doncic that they will constantly try to build a winner. And I think the only way to do that is to get him another star. And for more amazing content, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can be a part of the grind. And with that being said, go. Hey, hey. Motivated all about cash flow. Ran it up and ran out of excuses. In the field and we turn into hoops. For the clip like bonds we show. Just like some soldiers we choke. Step back three, we hoping. We on house just like Fortnite.